What's up everyone, it's Stacko Cakes and I'm back with another Madden 18 video. I've been reading the forums and people keep on having trouble with the uh, second game against the Oakland Raiders in the Team of the Week solos. So I figured, you know what, I'll show you how to, guys how to get this done. I did it the first time, I, I didn't think that anyone would have difficulty with it because it's a, a fa fairly long game as well. But um, people are having difficulty with it, so I figured, you know what, I'll... I'll boot it back up. I'll do it over again. I'm not going to get any uh, coins for it, but we'll get the XP for it as well, right? So I'll show you guys what I do to beat this. Let's get back to it. So we start uh, down 8 with 541 left in the third. So what I'm just going to do is I'm just going to blitz every single play. The time when I beat this, the first time I did it, when I beat it, I just uh, they actually scored on this first play with a touchdown, and uh, I, I can still beat it fairly easily after that. So let's just try to get a stop here. Oh, that's good. That's a good start right there. So we're just blitzing. Blitz again. And then what I'm going to do for offense is I'm going to just run the clock. Because this game is, is way too long. So that's going to make the game a bit shorter. That was a good, good catch there. Third and 13. Blitz again over Storm Brave. Reggie White's perfect for these solos. And there he goes. Okay. So what I'm going to do is, when I get the ball right here, I'm going to go for two, just so we can tie the game. Wait, I guess they're going to go for a field goal, so I guess I can't tie the game. Unless <laughs> I can block this. Uh... Of course, they missed it as I ran into the. How did I run to the kicker? I missed them. What? So that's definitely not a good start here. But like I said, the, the last time I did it, they actually scored a touchdown here, so it doesn't really matter. It doesn't really matter. We are gonna have to get a stop though eventually. This is just the unconventional way of doing it. <laughs> Okay. Blitz again, blitz again. We're using the uh, Cleveland Browns playbook for the offense. Supposedly they patched the the uh, inside zone gun monster, but they uh, it's still working fine today. So maybe it was just uh, patched for online play, possibly. I'm not really sure. But so it's third down right here. Oh, incomplete. Let's go. Okay, so I'll make sure not to hit the kicker this time. So. Okay. So we're down by 11. So what I'm probably going to do here is I'm going to score quick with the first possession, get a stop, and then I'm going to run the clock out after that. So I'm also scoring quick here, just in case the Raiders happen to score on their next possession. So uh, I'll, try, I'll just chew the clock. But I'm going to do it fast anyways. Just go monster. Inside zone. Cleveland Browns playbook. So I'll probably just do hurry up, even though I have it on chew the clock. I want to stay up. Oh. So I'm just going to run down the middle of the field here. Oh, the, almost gone. Yeah, so they, they supposedly patched the, uh, the block shedding by the defensive line on this play. But I haven't noticed too much of a difference. The fourth quarter is long, so if you don't score like right off the bat here, it doesn't really uh, hurt anything. Third and two. 
Okay. My running back though is tired because he, he can barely like run past the line at this point. Get in! There we go. Oh, he's not in. What? Okay, so from first and goal from the one, I'll just use this, use the same play again. I was gonna use something different, but whatever. I thought I I turned off uh, two clock on that one. I did. I don't know why it uh, just ended the quarter right there. That's kind of weird. But we got seven minutes left. We got a long time to kill. So whatever. So there we go. So I think we're going to go for two anyways, just for fun. Uh, 17. Yeah, to make it a field goal game. Even though I'm not even going to go for the field goal, I'm going to be going for the touchdown anyways. But just to practice the uh, two-point conversion. So I'm going to go outside handoff, half-back stretch, the bottom one. That should be good to go. There we go. Okay, so now we need to get a stop, and then we need to kill the clock. Okay. So we do the same thing as last time. We're just going to blitz non-stop. Seems to be working. I'm just giving the blitzes that they recommend, actually, too. So it's not like I'm going into uh, some special blitzes or anything like that. Oh, yes. Deion Jones is amazing, by the way. Very glad I purchased him. So we go Overstorm Blitz on this one. Overstorm Brave, I believe it's called. Nice. Third and ten. Oh, he's right there! Tackle him. <laughs> there we go. That's good. So we got 524. So what we're just going to do is we're going to we're gonna chew the clock and just run the same uh, gun monster inside zone all the way down the field. We're going to try to get like uh, four or five yards per, per run. And then I'm just going to kind of run into the CPU because I don't want to get too far down the field because I got, I got a bunch of uh, time I got to kill here. So... Okay, so we got 439 left. Put it back on chew the clock. Chew the clock. Gun. Monster. Inside zone. Worst comes to worst, we got three timeouts and we can kick a field goal to go to overtime. So I'm just gonna go down right here. Make sure to hold R R B. Hold on to the ball. Because you you don't want to fumble it. Four minutes left. And the quarterback is actually split out wide there in the wildcat. And to give this time to the tailback. And some space here. And he'll get up to the 43. They have no timeouts, so we don't have to worry about them blowing all their timeouts and taking forever. So many teams want to throw the ball in this situation nowadays. I'm going to try getting it a little bit more downfield here. So this is going to take us to the two-minute warning. Once again, this is the Cleveland Browns playbook. Gun formation. Monster. Inside zone. Okay, so we're on the 41, so we got to get a bit further down the field here. We don't want to leave them any time to come back in this game, so... 
next play. Not a whole lot thereafter, but a nice gain. It's a six yard gain. So on the 35. Second and four. This drive is pretty clear. There's only one guy there. <laughs> wow, okay. Okay, so I'm gonna run into into the line one more time around the five, and then from there I'll just go in for the touchdown. Let's get 38 seconds right now. There we go, perfect to the four. And we're gonna take off to the clock, go inside zone. We're gonna take this clock down to about eight seconds. If some miracle happens that they actually do stop me here, I do have three timeouts, so I'm gonna go down to eight seconds before I hit the ball. I'll go right now. There we go. So we'll just kick the extra point here. And there we go. So yeah, my, my best advice for this solo is to use the Cleveland Browns playbook, use the gun monster inside zone play. It was patched, but it still works fine, just like it did every other day. And uh, for defense, all, all I did was just blitz every single play. I don't have any special blitzes. All I did was I, I used the Madden suggestion blitzes. And if the Madden suggestion didn't give me a blitz, and I just audible to a blitz. So, oh, and that's game. And that's how you beat this one. Hopefully this video helps you guys out. The, the big thing is clock management as well. You want to use that chew the clock because you, you want to try to get the game over as quick as possible. Like I said before, I don't get any coins for this one because I, I did this one already. But uh, I just want to do it again to show you guys how to get this done. Hopefully this helps. Put some comments down below. Let me know if this helped you get past it. And if you guys ever have any of these videos that you guys want to see for certain solos, let me know because um, I kind of didn't think that anybody really wanted me to do this one, but I keep on seeing people on the forum asking me about it, so I figured, okay, I'm going to do a, a video how to beat this one. So I hope this helped you guys out. Put some likes down below if it did, and subscribe if you guys want, and then you guys can figure out uh, when my next video is coming. And by the way, thanks for hitting 2,000 subs. It's been great. I've been I got a thousand subs I think the last week or whatever. So it's been great up to 2000 now. I really appreciate it guys. Thanks for watching. Have a great day and I'll see you guys soon.